again and welcome to day 7 of Vlogmas. This is a little late, but I have a life and I have things to do, like watch the dog. That was fun. But anyway, today I'm making a dragon. I draw a lot of dragons, hence the name, Funny Dragons. But I've been drawing dragons since probably was a teenager, early teens, and I'm not really sure why. I think it's from reading the Dragon Riders of Pern books and when I was younger and stuff, and I can't read them now, but whatever. Um, not getting into that in this video. And, uh, so I think maybe that's what, so I've been dra drawing dragons ever since, where they're cute ones, kind of mean ones. I can't really do, like, mean, like, raw dragons, but I try, and they tend to, nine times out of ten, end up looking cute. I can't really help it. I've, you know, I don't know. It's it's a problem, but this one is kind of cute. He he ends up very green and red, but that's what I'm done when I color him. But he's a little pudgy at the moment, and I'm giving him wings here, like little arm things that for wings. Um, I'm like that looks cute. We can leave it like that. No, not really. But I turn them into a like little spiky arm things and they're not in the right angle I need to move them and I do eventually and then just use the flat tool to make them more bone like we'll say I think so yeah they're more bone like and then tilt them a little bit because he was really odd angled move his feet a little bit um move the wing arm thingies I'm not sure arms wingies wingies <laughs> um but, uh, <laughs> I don't know what to call him. But now I'm going to work on his head. Give him a pointy nose and a pointy mouth. Which I do, I do, I do with a lot of dragons. I've got, like, a formula, which is okay. I need to change it occasionally, which is probably why I can't draw really angry dragons. But one day, maybe. Um, and this really, probably really, those two little balls there, I couldn't get rid of them. I had to Google the problem. And eventually, what, what they say is, copy the whole model paste it again, and then delete it. That's a pain in the ass. It really is, but it's, it's Sculptress, and it's a alpha program, I think, Hubby said. I think so. So, it has bugs, and which is annoying. And now I'm just working on his mouth. He looks really sad here, but I do sort of fix that. And he ends up looking more confused than anything, but his head is looks, looks kind of like a skull here. Kind of creepy. Not really Halloween-like. Or not, not Halloween, but I've got Halloween on the brain, apparently. Not very Christmas-like. So I'm adding the little wing membranes to his arms. Because he needs them to fly, of course. And technically the wings are way too small for something that size to fly. He could maybe glide, but even then he's so pudgy he'd probably just collapse. Which would be a problem. And then I'm giving him little spikes on his back. And that's okay. I, I could have changed them. I just wanted something simple. More cartoony-like, which is okay. And then I stretch up the arms and back to the face to try to get him looking to be not so sad. I've tried to give him a smile, but it doesn't really work. He just not uh, speak. He just ends up looking more bony and skeleton-like, but that's okay. What am I doing here? Oh, yes, this was so bloody tedious. Giving him scales on his neck and his belly all the way to almost the tip of his tail. This was so tedious. This took forever to do, and it actually crashed the program a couple times, which was really annoying. I think it's the triangle count, which, if you notice on the lower left, yeah, lower left, is keeps going up and up and up. So that's probably the why it crashed so much. But it shouldn't be the computer. The thing is, my computer is freaking a workstation. It does. It's pretty damn powerful. And but this program just crashes all the time. Like I said, it's because it's not a finished program. Um, and I don't have the finished. Product. I actually don't know if they did finish it. They might have done something with it. I don't know. It works for me. It's just buggy a little bit, which pisses me off. But yeah. And like I said, very tedious this part. I could have made this a lot faster when I went through the editing and video because it was so bloody tedious and it's probably tedious to watch. See, I gave up. I didn't even do the whole tale. I, I just was like, nah, screw it. I'm done. I'm not going to do the whole thing. <laughs> so it's kind of being lazy. So I changed the material color because I couldn't quite see his toes, which I gave him toes instead of one solid foot. Messed with his hips a little bit. Added a bit of detail around his belly scales so they don't look like they're just stuck on with glue. And it, it kind of works, it kind of doesn't. 
And of course, I give him a pole pack, which, you know, they all seem to have. Which I do end up turning into, a, obviously, a Christmas, like, Santa hat. But it, it just reminds me of a pole pack every time I do it. And I don't know why. And why was I trying to give him a scarf? I don't know, because it was... I just forgot that it pisses me off. And then I used his wings a little bit, copied his little arm, which I thought, okay, we'll give him another... Oh, I can't even think what you'd call it. Little arm attached to the wings. It's like when you see bats, they've got like little ar arms and the wing membranes and stuff. Um, so I put an angle that and then just end up shrinking it eventually when it starts acting properly. Because it's starting to really bug me at this point. This took a lot longer than I thought it would. Which is why this is a little late. Because this took forever. And it's my own fault. Because I started kind of late, but I don't even know what time I got up today. But was it late? I don't remember. I'm not a morning person, so really me getting up before 11 is a miracle in, in itself. Which I should get up earlier so I can get these finished and uploaded earlier. And then we have the finished dragon. I kind of just jumped from me working on it to the finished dragon. I think it's because sculptors kept freezing in. It was just, you know, screw it. We'll turn everything else off but sculptors. And then hopefully get it finished by tonight, which I did. So two different versions, plus a turntable, which is great. And then it's done. And I'm glad it's done. And it's a little late, but that's my own fault, like I said. Um, so thank you for watching day 7. I want to say day 8, because technically it's the, today is the 8th. But tomorrow I'll have another video up. Hopefully a little earlier. <laughs>